Hey guys, what's up? Bisectatron here from Clash of Clans Manual. I'm still working on getting the audio issue a little bit better, but in the meantime, have a new video, and this one, uh, kind of an old series I haven't done in a little while, but I want to do a live farming uh, episode for you guys, um, just because I mainly focus on war, but uh, farming can be important, and it's, you know, it's important because you have to get your heroes, your troops up, um, and the strategy I'm using is a Super Queen or um, Queen Walk, however you want to call it. Uh, basically, just a bunch of healers and the Queen. Going to let her um, make her way into the base, mainly going for Dark Elixir. And if, in pretty much every attack, if you can get her to the center of that base and take out that Dark Elixir storage, um, that's a success because that's really all I'm farming right now. And healers are kind of expensive, but they cost Elixir, which I'm not worrying about. So if you're just looking for Dark Elixir, this is a good strategy to use. Anyway, looking at this base, um, I want to get that storage in the middle, plus uh, the pumps, or the, sorry, the Elixir drills on the outside. So I'm going to drop her down. I'll just put two healers for right now. Um, you want to keep those healers away from the air defenses. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and wait and see where she goes. Wait, basically, you want to bring some minions and use those to funnel her in uh, the way you want her to go. So I'm going to try to push her into the base right here. I'll drop a few more healers just in case some defenses lock onto her, uh, which they will in just a moment. And now I'm going to do my best to wall break in uh, and hopefully get her going into this base. Going to drop some minions up here and then a wizard. That'll kind of funnel her in uh, on that side. And a few more healers because there are some quite a few defenses on her right now. Uh, so going to make sure she's healed up. I'll go ahead and put the remaining healers on her. Uh, she should step up and take out that air defense uh, in a minute. And just so you know, uh, unless it's at a weird angle, the air defense actually can't reach the queen while she is uh, shooting it. it sorry, the air defense can't reach the healers while the queen is shooting it unless there's a funny angle. So you can see right here, uh, the queen should step up and take out that air defense, and the healers will never be in range of it. Uh, so that's kind of cool how that works out. I'm going to go ahead and drop a jump spell to try to let the queen get closer to that dark elixir storage. Um, she should take that jump. There we go. Uh, CC troops coming out, dropping the poison. Going to pop the queen's ability as she takes out the enemy queen um, and deals with these archers. And then in the meantime, I'll go ahead and get the town hall with the wizard. And yeah, things are looking pretty good. I usually bring two jump and two rage. The jumps are always helpful to get the queen moving in the right direction. And then the rages uh, can either be used on the healers or the queen, or both, uh, to get more damage coming out and more healing from the healers. Uh, you can see the air defense is locked on um, to my healers. I'm going to go ahead and use these minions to distract and take it out. Uh, it looks like the queen stepped up anyway. Uh, so that all works out. Um, now she's onto a wall. I'm going to go ahead and I guess I'll rage her just because I want her to get some of those elixir storages. Uh, like I said, I'm not farming elixir, but I'll definitely take it because there's quite a bit available. So I'm going to rage her to get those uh, to get the elixir. And then I'm also going to try to get the rest of that dark elixir down here. So I'm going to go ahead and send my king on a little bit of a walk. I'll let him walk around. Then I'll try to sneak a wizard in and get that drill. Actually, you know what? I'll go ahead and funnel him in if I can. No, if that's actually not going to work. Let's see if I can do this um, and get him to go on in. Come on, there we go. King goes in, I'm getting another 400 from that. I'll go ahead and let him die. He's not that important to the attack. Um, and it looks like that's all I'm going to get, unless the queen steps up and, you know, she's on the Tesla. So got half of the elixir, which is fine. Not that worried about it. Just need enough to pay for my army. And any extra just goes into walls. But the main thing is dark elixir, you know, trying to get those heroes up at 25, 24 right now. So still have a ways to go before I'm 30, 30, which is max for Town Hall 9. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and drop a like if you did. I'll see you guys in some later war recaps and stuff like that, so stay tuned. Uh, but yeah, bye, Sactatron out.